you're gonna need a condom. I came up here, I closed the door. I don't know if I'm gonna post this or not because I don't know what's going on. A lot of times I record things that don't make it into a video because um, I try to document things as they're happening and then like if nothing comes of it, then obviously whatever I recorded like didn't make it into a video, okay? So I'm gonna talk about this right now, but I don't know if it's gonna make it into a video. But my husband has been acting really weird and I'm just recording this right now because if something's up, I'm suspicious. I don't know what it is, but I don't know. I probably sound like a freaking crazy woman right now. <laughs> okay, so this is going to be the what? The first ent entry. To entry this. number one. <laughs> if you guys don't know already, or have any idea what is going on, well, obviously they don't have. Nobody's before. gonna know. If you are seeing this video, you have already, right. the event has already happened. Why is this so hard? I know! Mark's got to get what you need her. She already know what to say. I know. This is basically like a top secret mission right now. Um, basically what's happening is this is going to mark the 10th year that Jessica has been on YouTube. Myself, Hello. Hannah, <laughs> Rosalind. <laughs> I have to focus on you. Janelle is helping. Look at We've all this conversation. Yeah. But wait, wait there's, there's more. more. We have a champagne room. With all of our special guests. People. So I actually had to make a group chat and Instagram so that notifications wouldn't go to my phone because I have notifications turned off through social media because I get so many. I actually made it to where we have basically like a management thread, all the people that are actually physically planning this party. And then I have a whole nother one for all the other YouTubers that Jessica watches that she kind of looks up to and just all of her friends that she knows through social media. So that we can remember. Yeah, that, that we can, can remember. remember. Yes, I don't know if I got everybody. I know I got a lot of people invited. There's a couple people who I don't think are gonna be able to make it. We have a group called Rosalind's Extra Fancy Party with Minor Details, which Jessica is quote unquote invited to and she's gonna be shopping for like a formal attire for all the kids and all of that stuff. So she thinks there's an event happening, but she, she doesn't, doesn't know, know that the event is for her. And she's yeah. gonna be doing all the decorations for her own party. Yeah, she's, she's planning her own party. party. She doesn't know. She has no clue. We have Wendy on board. We have pretty much all of her friends. Everybody is in on it. She has absolutely no idea. Currently, supposedly, Chris is helping Ryan move some heavy stuff and we need to just mess most of <laughs> Addie's here and Jessica doesn't care what, where Chris is at this point because Addie's not at home, so she can work making a vlog for you guys. There you go. We have a lot of big plans. We don't know how many of the plans are actually going to work out, but we are planning this way in advance to make sure that everything is as perfect as possible and to get everything that we need to order or customize before it's too late. But this is the intro to planning Jessica's secret super 10 year anniversary party. It is October 17th, and I think the last time that we talked, I want to say it was still September. While Jess is gone, this is like the perfect time to go and get everything that we need for this party. So I'm going to take advantage of that, and Addie and I, she's back there, are going to go to Target in Party City and just pick up all of like the little things, like the plates and the napkins, some balloons, and all of that. We finally picked a cater. We're going to have tacos. We picked the menu. As far as our guest list, our guest list is pretty solid with some pretty amazing people who all love Jessica as much as we do. The thing about this party is that it has to be perfect and it has to be amazing. Like Jessica celebrating her 10th year on YouTube, 10 years, and I hope she's surprised. That's the biggest thing. We almost had a slip up. It was real bad, but we covered it. Hey, good friend. 
no, I'm serious. Like, I, here's the thing is that, like, we can't afford everything for this party because we just did our carpets and everything, and so... Oh my god. <laughs> Do we need to just make the minimum payment? We don't have to pay our mortgage this month. Long story short, I'm in the middle of moving. Can we talk about this in like <laughs> 45 minutes after I'm done with Chris? Can we talk about it on Sunday? I promise you, I'll give you my firstborn. Actually, no, I'll give you all three of mine. <laughs> oh my God, guys. So I'm like freaking out now. So Chris charged some stuff on his credit card for the party and Jessica just found it. So it's literally Monday the 4th. The party is on the 9th. And she found all the charges, so they just called Roseland. You're not lying. We had to borrow money to do this party. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. I've never lied to you. But for real, so can you help us move all this stuff? You can have them. Take them. Okay. All right. See you in a bit. Bye. Oh, my God. Do you have it all? Do you have it all? I have it all. That's rad, dude. That's rad. I mean, you could, we couldn't have FaceTimed at a better time. This I thought, I really thought that we were gonna have to blow the secret. What is it though? It's the porta potties. Why did I, I told Chris that my brother was even willing to pay for it. So we invited Tracy, your manager. It has Alyssa Rose, Brittany and Baby, Shannon Rose, your husband, Dear Grayson, AKA Alex, Janelle, Nami Lahorn, Kira from OK Baby, and Talia, AKA Sun Kiss Mama. So we're all in a group chat and they're all, they're all flying in tomorrow to see you. And you have no idea and I cannot wait. Jessica, you are the most selfless person I have like ever met. You're the type of person where like everything could be going wrong in your life and you're worried about everybody else's. And like for me, like everybody thinks that like I'm friends with your kids because I am, but like you're like the big sister I never had. Like you're literally like my person to go to when like I mess everything up <laughs> because it happens a lot and you know that. So like this is my way of like showing you how many people actually like love you like that's literally it all these people dropped what they were doing to come celebrate you if that's not a reflection of how amazing person you are like i don't know what is i'm trying to like say it without like being hella sappy because like it's insane like we've been keeping secrets like we've been turning off locations like all this stuff like hella sneaking around also terrell terrell and jarius are coming too and i can't wait it's gonna be so good so friday november 8th we told jessica that we were taking her we honestly didn't tell her where we were taking her we just said that we were taking her away and that's it so i'm gonna call her and we put together a list of things that she needs <laughs> we literally just like pick this out of our butt like just random things so i'm gonna see what she says are you ready no <laughs> okay so i have your packing list for tomorrow i want you to pack in that small um it just has to be like kind of small like yeah, yeah, yeah. like I'm a carry-on size i the one that i brought to um yeah that one works as long as it's okay. like small and doesn't take up a ton of space okay okay so the next thing that you're gonna need is a bathing suit a bathing suit yes you're gonna, <laughs> this is kind of hard. Okay, you're gonna need socks. And they don't have to match. Should I purposely not match them? No, it doesn't matter, but like, I mean, life's too short to match your socks. I think mine are already matched to my drawer, so I can just grab a, a wad. Okay. And, okay, like one pair? Um, yeah, one, yeah, one pair. Okay. Um, you're gonna need at least two of your cameras. I need to charge my batteries. And you're gonna need all of your extra batteries. And then you're gonna need toothpaste. Okay. 
And then you're gonna need a tissue box. I oh, what? A tissue box? Like with tissues. A box of tissues. Yeah, a tissue box. Yeah, can, can I bring a travel pack? Um, yeah, I suppose. Okay, so a box. You're gonna need comfortable shoes. So either your Burks or like something that you're okay walking in. Burks it is. And then you're gonna need, you're gonna need a condom. Why? Is she serious about that one? I don't have a condom, so I don't. Okay, well, instead of a condom, just bring a, just bring a pen. Yeah, just like a regular, like a ballpoint pen, like black or blue, but don't make it like a colored one. <laughs> so cross the condom off the list and put a pen on. Yeah, because we'll substitute it. It'll it'll work out. It'll make sense once we're there. Oh, f okay, continue. Okay, that's it. That's it. Yeah. That's it. I would maybe pack another pair of underwear though. A bathing suit. A bathing suit. It's what? November. Okay, and? Be outdoors. Okay. Don't you know, didn't you ever play with Polly Pockets? No. The, oh. <laughs> Polly Pocket had an airplane with a hot tub in it. Oh, that would be cool. Is that what we're doing? A hot, an airplane with a hot tub in it? That'd be cool. That would be very cool. Okay, are you sipping your tea? I'm sipping my tea. I'm trying to think if you need anything else. Chris, can you think of anything? If I need a bathing suit, do I need a GoPro? No. No. Got it. You're not going underwater. This is weird. You're just so gonna get more, wet. I'm more confused. <laughs> <laughs> I'm more confused than when I started. Good. Oh, Chris, should we have her bring a roll of paper towels? No, it's too big. Okay. And then honestly, like anything else that you would need like to travel with. Did you get toothpaste? Yeah, toothpaste. Should I bring my toothbrush? No, you won't need it. What the f <laughs> Bring toothpaste but not toothbrush. Like do I bring a little one or do I bring a fat one? No, bring your big one. Bring a big thing of toothpaste. What Car if it's almost empty? Oh, I mean it would be easier if it was full but an empty one's fine too. Any okay. final words? <laughs> Am I gonna come back alive? Probably not. Are you guys kidnapping me and then not bringing me back? Just make sure like in the morning that you're like ready to go. Like hair curled, eyebrows on, mascara, eyeliner. Eyebrows on. Eyebrows on. I've packed extra of everything except for a few of the things. So I mean, as long as you have some of it. Everybody bringing this list? Um, no, everybody has a different list because we all need different items. What the f okay. Yeah? I think so. Do you have any last, like, questions, concerns, anything? I have a lot of concerns. Okay, well, honestly, I can't help you with that one. I just want to know why a condom and a ballpoint pen are interchangeable. <laughs> Guess you'll have to wait and find out. I'll okay. see you in the morning. Okay, love you. Love you. Oh my god, guys, she really needs, literally needs none of that. I'm dead. I can't believe she's falling for all of this. I'm so confused and I like really don't like this feeling. She's like, what the hell is going on? Come on. I'm going to get Jessica and you can open your eyes now.